Welcome to the fascinating world of gravitational waves, a concept that has revolutionized our understanding of the universe. Gravitational waves, these ripples in the fabric of space-time, are not just figments of theoretical physics, but tangible phenomena that have been detected and measured. In the early 20th century, a certain physicist named Albert Einstein revolutionized our understanding of gravity. His theory of general relativity described gravity not as a force, but as a consequence of the warping of space-time by mass and energy. Among the many startling predictions of this theory was the existence of gravitational waves. These waves, much like ripples spreading out when a stone is thrown into a pond, are disturbances in the curvature of space-time caused by the movements of massive objects. Picture the universe as a giant rubber sheet, and imagine what happens when a heavy ball, say, a planet or a star, is placed on this sheet. It sinks in, causing the sheet around it to warp. Now if this ball were to move, it would create ripples on the sheet, and these ripples would travel outward from their source. That's a simplistic way to visualize gravitational waves. But these waves are extraordinarily elusive. Their effect on space-time is so minute that for a long time, their detection remained a theoretical challenge. It wasn't until a century after Einstein's prediction that technological advancements finally caught up, enabling us to directly observe these elusive waves. The detection of gravitational waves marked a significant turning point in our exploration of the cosmos. It opened up a new window into the universe, providing us with a novel way to study celestial events. Gravitational waves carry information about their dramatic origins and about the nature of gravity that cannot otherwise be obtained. The journey of gravitational waves from theory to observation is a testament to the power of human ingenuity. It's a story of perseverance, of pushing the boundaries of what we know, and of a relentless pursuit of knowledge. And it's a story that's still being written as we continue to explore the universe through the lens of gravitational waves. Our journey begins with Albert Einstein, whose general theory of relativity first predicted gravitational waves. Einstein, a name synonymous with genius, unveiled his groundbreaking theory in 1915, challenging our understanding of the universe. In the heart of this theory, Einstein proposed a revolutionary concept, space-time. He pictured the universe not as three separate dimensions of space and one of time, but as a single four-dimensional fabric. This fabric, he suggested, could be curved and warped by mass and energy. When objects with mass accelerate, they distort the fabric of space-time, creating ripples, or what we now call gravitational waves. Einstein's gravitational waves are akin to the ripples created when a stone is thrown into a pond. Just as the stone's impact sends waves across the water, accelerating masses send waves across the fabric of space-time. These waves travel at the speed of light, carrying information about their cataclysmic origins. However, Einstein himself doubted these waves could ever be detected. They were predicted to be incredibly weak, their effects diminishing rapidly with distance. To capture these elusive ripples, one would need an instrument sensitive enough to detect a change smaller than the size of an atom over a distance of several kilometers, a challenge that seemed insurmountable. Despite the skepticism, Einstein's prediction of gravitational waves spurred on a century-long quest for their detection. It was a journey filled with trials and tribulations, punctuated by technological advancements, international collaborations, and the unwavering determination of scientists worldwide. So, while Einstein set the stage with his theory, it was up to future generations to bring the prediction to fruition. Little did he know, his theoretical ripples in space-time would one day open a new window to the cosmos offering us a fresh perspective on the universe's most violent phenomena. Einstein's prediction laid the foundation for a century-long quest to observe these elusive ripples in space-time, a journey that would eventually lead us to one of the most significant discoveries in the history of physics, the first direct detection of gravitational waves. Enter LIGO and Virgo, two international collaborations that played a pivotal role in this quest. LIGO, short for Laser Interferometer Gravitational Wave Observatory, and Virgo are giants in the world of gravitational wave research. But what are they exactly? Well, they're mega science projects featuring some of the most sensitive instruments in the world. Now let's talk about LIGO first. It's a large scale observatory designed specifically for detecting cosmic gravitational waves and for scientific research. It's a project funded by the National Science Foundation and operated by the California Institute of Technology and the Massachusetts Institute of Technology. On the other hand, we have Virgo, a gravitational wave observatory located near Pisa, Italy. 
It's a collaboration between Italy and France, but it's not just a European project. Over the years, teams from all over the world have joined the Virgo collaboration. So how do these observatories work? They employ a method known as laser interferometry to measure the tiny disturbances that gravitational waves cause in the fabric of space-time. Both LIGO and Virgo consist of two arms forming an L-shape. A laser beam is split and sent down the arms, bouncing off mirrors before recombining. When a gravitational wave passes through, it distorts space-time, causing the distance traveled by the light in each arm to change slightly. This change is what these observatories are designed to detect. It's an incredibly sensitive process, and it requires a level of precision that is almost unimaginable. The observatories have to measure changes smaller than one thousandth the diameter of a proton. It's like trying to measure the distance from here to the nearest star with an accuracy smaller than the width of a human hair. These collaborations brought us one step closer to detecting these elusive waves. The combined efforts of LIGO and Virgo have opened up a new window into the universe, allowing us to hear the ripples in space-time caused by some of the most violent and energetic processes in the cosmos. The tale of gravitational waves is a testament to human curiosity and ingenuity, and it's only just begun. On August 17, 2017, the world witnessed a historic event, the detection of gravitational waves from a cosmic event now known as GW170817. This was not just another day in the cosmos. It was a day that marked a new era in the field of astrophysics. What makes GW170817 so significant? Well, picture this. Two neutron stars spiraling into each other, creating ripples in the fabric of space-time. These ripples or gravitational waves traveled across the universe at the speed of light, finally reaching our detectors here on Earth. The Laser Interferometer Gravitational Wave Observatory, or LIGO, in collaboration with the Virgo Observatory in Italy, detected a signal. This signal was unlike anything they had seen before. It was a chirp that lasted for about 100 seconds, much longer than previous detections. But why is this important? This detection confirmed that gravitational waves could carry information from cosmic cataclysms millions of light years away. It was like unlocking a new way to see the universe, a testament to the power of human curiosity and ingenuity. Furthermore, the detection of GW170817 was even more groundbreaking because it was the first event observed through both gravitational waves and light. This was the dawn of what scientists call multi-messenger astronomy, a new way of studying the universe that combines different types of signals. The discovery of GW170817 was a turning point in the field of astrophysics. It showed us that gravitational waves are not just theoretical predictions, but real phenomena that we can observe and measure. As a result of this detection, we can now explore the universe in ways we never thought possible. We can study cosmic events that are otherwise invisible to us and unlock the secrets of the universe that have been hidden for billions of years. This detection marked a new chapter in the study of the universe. It was a significant step forward in our understanding of the cosmos, and it showed us that the universe is much more fascinating and complex than we could ever imagine. The detection of gravitational waves was a feat so remarkable that it earned the 2017 Nobel Prize in Physics. This prestigious award, given by the Royal Swedish Academy of Sciences, was shared by three key contributors to the gravitational wave discovery, Rainer Weiss, Kip Thorne, and Barry C. Barish. Rainer Weiss, a professor at the Massachusetts Institute of Technology, was the first to conceive of a way to detect gravitational waves back in the 1970s. He proposed a method using laser interferometry, an idea that would later become the foundation of the Laser Interferometer Gravitational Wave Observatory, or LIGO. For his instrumental role in the conceptual development of gravitational wave detection, Weiss was awarded one half of the Nobel Prize. The other half was shared by Kip Thorne and Barry C. Barish, both of the California Institute of Technology. Thorne's theoretical work laid the groundwork for predicting what the signal from a gravitational wave might look like, while Barish was the driving force that brought the LIGO project to fruition. Under his leadership, LIGO evolved from an ambitious idea to a groundbreaking scientific instrument. When the Nobel Prize was announced, it wasn't just a recognition of these three individuals, but of the entire international teams that worked on the LIGO and Virgo projects. It was a celebration of a collaborative effort that spanned decades and continents, involving hundreds of scientists, engineers, and technicians. The Nobel Prize also brought gravitational waves into the spotlight, igniting public interest in this esoteric aspect of physics. 
Suddenly, the world was talking about space-time ripples and cosmic collisions, bringing a sense of wonder and excitement to the usually abstract world of theoretical physics. This Nobel Prize was a testament to the groundbreaking work of these scientists and their teams. Their collective effort has opened up a new window onto the universe, allowing us to listen to the cosmos in a way we could never have imagined before. The discovery of gravitational waves has far-reaching implications for our understanding of the universe. It's much like putting on a pair of spectacles and seeing the cosmos in a whole new light. Suddenly, we have access to a universe that was previously invisible to us. We can now hear the sounds of cosmic events, such as the collision of massive objects like black holes and neutron stars. Gravitational waves are ripples in the fabric of space-time, and their detection has opened a new window into the universe. These waves provide us with a unique way to observe events that would otherwise be hidden from our view. For instance, the collision of black holes, which does not emit light, can now be observed through the gravitational waves they produce. This breakthrough has truly revolutionized the field of astronomy. But what does the future hold for gravitational wave detection? Well, the prospects are indeed exciting. In the near future, we can expect to see improvements in the sensitivity of gravitational wave detectors. This will allow us to detect more events and further away, giving us a deeper understanding of the universe. There are also plans to launch gravitational wave observatories in space, which would not be affected by earthly vibrations and could detect lower frequency waves. Moreover, gravitational wave astronomy holds the promise of testing theories of gravity in regimes where they have not been tested before. This could potentially lead to the discovery of new physics. Indeed, the detection of gravitational waves is just the first step. The real journey of discovery has just begun. The field of gravitational wave astronomy is still in its infancy and there is much we have yet to learn. But one thing is certain, the discovery of gravitational waves has opened up a new chapter in our understanding of the universe. It is a testament to human curiosity and the relentless pursuit of knowledge. With the door to gravitational wave astronomy now open, the future of this field is bright with possibilities. From Einstein's prediction to a Nobel Prize winning discovery, the journey of gravitational waves has been nothing short of extraordinary. The relentless pursuit of knowledge in the face of seemingly insurmountable challenges led to one of the most groundbreaking discoveries in physics. The Laser Interferometer Gravitational Wave Observatory, or LIGO, and the Virgo collaboration were instrumental in this achievement, detecting the elusive ripples in space-time that Einstein had predicted nearly a century earlier. The detection of the gravitational wave event, GW170817, not only validated Einstein's theory of general relativity, but it also ushered in a new era of multi-messenger astronomy. This has provided us with a whole new way to observe and study cosmic phenomena, enriching our understanding of the universe. The 2017 Nobel Prize in Physics was a testament to the significance of this discovery and its ongoing impact on the field. As we continue to explore the universe through gravitational waves, who knows what new mysteries we might uncover.